What we need to do now is throw up an ad on one of these billboards, like and subscribe. This is how we bing them, everybody. Hello and good morning everyone. Guys, good morning. Welcome back. This is a little different. We're out here today. We are already at Central Park, the Bethesda Mount Mindy. How do you say it? Bethesda. Bethesda. <laughs> <laughs> but I could not get it right for a long time, okay? Starting the day off right. This is the best of the death. Now, if you guys recall, this was supposed to be just like a girls' trip. We've talked about that, that I got to tag along. It's Today, more fun with you this here. morning, we're starting off the day doing a very Mindy and Maddie thing. We're doing a little Gossip Girl reunion tour. Is that what we're doing here? Uh, today? Yes, there are some iconic parts of Gossip Girl that are here in New York City. We are starting off at Central Park. We have a few other places we want to hit. want to hit the Met and yeah. a bunch of other stuff that I don't know about, but Nate I'm here. Archibald's Challenge. <laughs> but today we have so much going on. In fact, I hear a helicopter flying overhead. The day is culminating and finishing oh, off I see one with right a there. helicopter tour. New York City, we're going to be doing oh. the 9-11 memorial today. Yeah. And then we may be hitting up Times Square to finish off our last full day here in New York together Sounds as a family. So beyond perfect. Yeah. On to the next thing, we're gonna head to the Met. It is just a quick walk through Central Park. The ladies grab something at the boathouse. We've got, what kind of muffin did you get? Blueberry. Blueberry muffin, chocolate, chocolate croissant. croissant. That is how you start a day in Central Park, people. Apparently, our Met Gala invites were delayed in the mail. <laughs> So we're here a little bit late, but we are at the mat. We're gonna go in. Sean Mendes, I think, is just inside. He said he's gonna wait for us. We'll see if he's there. Anybody else, maybe, who's left over from the Met Gala? But let's go in and see what they got. up our time at the Met. Was that fantastic? I really like it. I think Maddie it's loved it. You so guys, fun. she is a cultured young woman. She was well, loving the art, reading all of the history behind it. Well, it was just cool because I took a Western Humanities class last semester at BYU. So it was just cool to see all the stuff we like learned and studied come to life. In real life. And so, see, like, see the artists that we studied and their other paintings. Very cool experience and it ended up being the bulk of our time. So we didn't get to do the Gossip Girl tour. But hey. I think we got to do what Maddie wanted most and that's what that's I think matters most. And I am grateful because I'm not getting rip about gossip girl. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, now that we are done here, we are headed off. We've got tickets for the 9-11 Memorial Tour. Hi on Maddie's list of things to do. One of our favorite things that we did last time we came, yes, so we can't wait to special. experience that with her. We're about to go into the 9-11 Memorial where we can't do a lot of talk or anything like that. Something that we really enjoyed the first time we wanted to be able to experience with Maddie. Just got out of the 9 11 Memorial, and that is something that I would highly recommend to anybody who's making a trip to New York, even if you live here and you haven't had a chance to do it yet. It was absolutely amazing in a way of like seeing the magnitude of what happened that day. It really bring you into it, help you feel it and experience it. Something that I want to take the kids through for sure because they weren't even alive for it. It's something that is part of history for them. But absolutely incredible in every sense. Now it is time to change gears up a little bit, grab a quick bite to eat. We are walking down the streets of New York City on our way to go get in a helicopter, fly high above this city, out and around the Statue of Liberty, seeing everything there is to see in a quick 15 minute chopper ride over the Big Apple.
We just got off of our first ever New York City helicopter tour. Oh, you guys, How was it? It was incredible. Seeing everything we've seen from ground level now above it was just taking the trip to a whole new level. But even seeing where we were on the edge, when we went to the edge last night and how oh. high that felt, and we were flying above it looking down at it, it's insane to think about how high it we was were. Insane. It was and you so guys, cool. I don't think I realized this until we were walking out there that Maddie didn't do Hawaii. So this was her oh. first helicopter Oh my gosh, tour. I was just going to say we've got this to compare to Hawaii, but you're right, she had to go home because she's she was so into her study. She's so concerned about missing class and missing school that she didn't get a chance to do the helicopter tour. But guess what? Turned out she ended up getting a scholarship to VIU, so I think she ended up <laughs> taking the better end of that deal. You. But still got the helicopter ride. So first helicopter ride ever. Yeah. Patty, what did you think? It was so amazing. <laughs> oh my God, I can't even put it into words. Just... The pictures just don't do it justice. They it's really the feeling don't. of floating, of hovering, of being over and above, having those headsets on, listening to air traffic, talking to the pilot, yeah. the whole thing. The pilot was, was awesome. Was incredible. Oh, he is a rock star. He flew that thing like a boss. It was so smooth. The entire flight incredibly smoothly yeah. flew all the way down and back saw everything we wanted to it see it was so cool So we decided to do a little bit of Soho shopping before we head to dinner. And I gotta say, I'm probably standing in one of the coolest stores I've ever seen in my entire life. It's shoes made entirely of recycled rubber, and they all smell like bubble gum. So the entire store smells like bubble gum. This is not something you normally, Mindy, you don't, you never normally smell a pair of shoes. I would wear these. But they smell like bubble gum. Yeah, I would buy these. These are so cool, and it's probably the coolest store we've walked in so far. Way cool store. <laughs> feeling super hungry tonight so we haven't had some like true Italian yet. They've had a lot of pizza but not any like not real pasta. true Italian. I think everybody's wanting some pasta. Stopped here at Serafina for some dinner tonight. We're gonna have some delicious pasta. Hang out, enjoy the beautiful sights and sounds of outdoor seating. So beautiful pretty out there. outside. They have such a fun patio set up out there. And then I think the idea is to finish off our last night here in Times Square. So I'm hoping Ooh. that we get a chance to go to Times Square, fully yes. lit up again once we finish dinner. It's so fun down there and it's like once in a lifetime to see it. As I've heard once from Brexit, if it's a once in a lifetime, you gotta do it twice. Yep. Take two in Times Square Time for us tonight. Square. But this time we're doing it up right, Maddie. We've got the full camera grab and walking around with the 360 oh, ball, getting some the stick shots. The pole is like the attention grabber of the night. <laughs> I feel bad. People started trying to pay me. They thought I was a street performer. I said, no, I'm just getting some footage for the vlog. Oh, like I and know. subscribe. This is just me being me. <laughs> this is just who I am. But it made it nice for the family. They could follow me anywhere in Times Square. You it's can easily true. find it's me. It's like you were the start of a tour. We are going to do it up in Times Square last night here in New York City. So we're going to take our time, enjoy it. Last time it was very late after the play. We only had our phones to video on. So tonight we wanted to come back, give Maddie the the full experience plus it happens to be Saturday night so it is hopping tonight it, it is yeah, a lot busier than the here. other night so we're gonna walk around see all there is to see here enjoy the bright lights of Times Square in New York City baby Heck yes <laughs> I actually decided to hit record because right now behind the camera Maddie is taking pictures of us doing our vlog yes. thing while the rest of Times Square takes notes and observes. Us in our true element right What we here. need to do now is throw up an ad on one of these billboards, like and subscribe. This is how we bing them everybody. <laughs> Thank you.
back in the room now. We're super tired, we are worn down, but I feel like we may want to do a little bit of packing up because we're checking out tomorrow. Tomorrow is our last day here, but we've gotta to head to the airport kind of midday with Maddie. We're flying out at night, but we're not taking off before we tackle the top of the Empire State Building. I mean, now we've seen the top of the Empire State Building, but now helicopter. we're gonna be standing on top of it. I'm like getting all the views All the, the views the you could strip. possibly get, guys. We will have done top of the rock, the edge, flown in the helicopter, and finishing off with Empire State Building. Doesn't get better than that, you guys. Make sure you come back tomorrow. It's gonna be an awesome, incredible end to this trip, and we get to go home and see the kids. Come back, we love you. See you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye.